Hey guys, welcome to a new series of videos I'm doing. Uh, it's called Put Down That Controller. So basically encourage you to put down the controller just for a little bit, pick up a book, namely your war book, and uh, have a read. Um, I'm gonna pick the ones that I have found to be the most interesting that I've read. Um, I have read some real stinkers, but the ones that stand out and I always recommend to people are the ones I'm gonna mention in these videos. So the first one is The Naked Island by Russell Braddon who was a Sydney sider, who was 20 when he enlisted in World War II and went to Malaya with the promise of an easy time, take your tennis racket, you know, relax, have some fun. The Jap Japanese will never come down. Uh, unfortunately for him and all those Australians in that, they were let down big time and the Japanese came and took Fortress Singapore and he ended up in Changi Prison along with all his mates, which was only about six months or so into his... Uh, his enlistment, so he spent from 1942 to 1945 as a POW in Changi, uh, as well as on the Burma Railway. Um, if you don't know much about Changi, pretty much everyone around that area went to Changi Prison first, and then they drew off in all these groups. So some went to, you know, Burma Railway as a promise of better food and shelter uh, if you come and work that way, or some someone went to San Sandarkin. Um, I don't know if you know about Sandarkin. But uh, it's one of the real tragedies of the war in the Pacific on the Australians, uh, which is, I do have some other books which I will mention another time. Uh, that's, that's a good thing about this book is once you read it, it, it's got so many branches that you'll start to go, okay, I want to know more about this one, I want to know more about that. And there's plenty of books to pick up and you know easy to find, which I, I've read as well, so they're going to get recommended as well. So yeah, he, he pretty much hung around and survived the war. Uh, in it. And what makes the book so special is that you know it's not it's not a historian looking at everything. It's he wrote it from his own experiences. He he doesn't gild the lily as such. It's pretty much raw and how it is. Uh, it's funny at times, but it's also really tragic. So uh, please, if you got some time, try and find the book. I, I think there's a link to this one. I'll put on the in the description um, that from a free ebook, so you can just download download it as a PDF and read it in your own time whenever you can. So I hope you enjoy the new uh, series on the channel and it uh, makes you go out and find a book, put down the controller and uh, read them. So I hope you enjoy. Thanks guys, catch us.